Hi guys, Steve here, and this is a quick video on how to use a paint spray gun. I'm doing this because I had to ask somebody when I first got one. If you've not seen my previous video on how to make colours and dyes, you can see it here. You would have started off with a brush, but it's a real pain when you've got a large area to paint. You've got to select each region, and then choose which colour to paint it. That's okay when it's a small house, but when it's a large base it's going to take forever. Plus you'll use more dye on a brush than you would on a paint gun. I would only use a brush now for touching up small areas like this. Now let's get on to the spray gun as we've got a large area to paint. Like the brush you'll need to fill the gun with dye. Now select the spray gun, it shows you what colours loaded and on the left hand side you've got text showing you which region is going to be painted. At the moment only region 1 is enabled. So when we use a spray gun, only that area is going to get painted. It's the same regions as a paintbrush, only you don't get a preview image of where the paint's going. To select the different regions, press the right mouse button, then press the corresponding key. 1 to 6 enables or disables each region. I've enabled them all, so now when I use a spray gun, every section of a wall gets covered. And that's much faster than using a paintbrush. If you wanted to do the highlight panels, and if you know or could guess a region number, you can quickly do all of them with your spray gun. Fill it with a new colour. I know one is a main section, so I'm going to disable that, then I'll just enable the others. that lets me do the entire wall quickly in one go. Every time you fill the gun with a new colour, it resets your region numbers, which is a bit of a pain, plus every time you equip the gun. As you can see, one's enabled where the rest go disabled. I'll do a range test to see how far you can spray the paint. The range is about half a floor tile away. I would have liked it to go further, but at least you don't have to hit each panel as you do with a brush. Well, that's it guys. Thanks for watching, and if it was helpful, please like and subscribe. Don't forget to check out other helpful videos at the end, and hopefully I'll see you again. Goodbye.